Hey, welcome back. So for today, I'm introducing the project we'll be working on for the next few class sessions. And the project is about a poster design contest. So first thing you're going to see on your Google Classroom is a link to this web page. And what we'd like you to do is just read a little bit about it. It's just this page, these few paragraphs here, talking about the Stop the Spread poster contest. And so what we'd like you to do, read through this first so you get a little more information about what the contest entails. And then you're going to swap over to this Google Doc and answer some questions about the contest. Now, some are just questions to make sure you've kind of read and you know what to plan for, like the size, the prize, um, who you're sending it to. But some of the questions are also for you to start planning how you might execute this design when you get to the design stage. You're not designing as of yet, but you are thinking about what you would want to include. So some questions I would really start you know, reflecting on is one, what method are you planning on using? Or do you want to use this digitally or would you like to do this by traditionally by hand, which both are acceptable for this. Another thing I'd like you to consider is you need examples of PSAs or public service announcements or infographics. Now an infographic is when people take data that can be kind of boring, like think charts and numbers, and they make it visually appealing to people. So you can kind of see it in a way that looks like art, but it's actually information. So what I'd like you to do is research a PSA example or an infographic, does it not have to be about COVID, just an example, and attach it to this document or to your assignment. Um, and just to speak on a few things, like what components of the design captures your attention? And I'd like you to write a little bit of information about the design you chose in here. I wanted to provide my own example so you know what I was talking about. So if you scroll down, you'll see an example of a PSA. Now this has to do with the COVID virus and it has information, right? It's just stop the spread, right? And it's very simple, but it's well executed and it's visually appealing. When you look at it, you want to know what it's about. And if I was going to write something in that little block about which one I chose, I talk about their the, the decisions they made about the characters they chose. None of them look stagnant. They all look like they're in motion or they're doing something, right? Their text is easy to read and their messaging is clear. So you're going to do this for your own example here and answer all these questions in full sentences, please.